nobody wins when the family feuds, man. Last night was nasty, 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 nasty work. Like to see two brothers going at it like that for the views for 6,000, 7,000 people in the chat. Like I respect it. I get it. But like we all got brothers and sisters and got into it over the most dumbest stuff. But for someone who is in a big boy ages, they in 30s and 40s. Right. They understand the power of social media, of influence and whatnot for them to get to that level. And so apparently T-Rail is mad at big deal for speaking on the AD situation while T-Rail and Smack was talking about the AD situation. But big deal was talking about it in the car and was told to come inside to do it on the podcast. But. It, it's confusing, but let's let's jump into it, man. Ain't no big deal on the way. We already spoke to him. He pulling up to speak on it, and got this creep watching me on the cam. We're gonna get into it. We're gonna let him work real quick. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Creep deal. I don't see no spot though, cause I really don't. We gonna have to. Uh... Have you heard about um? Yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, that's a commercial. No premium. That's a fact. This premium, no. That is premium, no. This smile, premium, no. This charisma, premium, though. My numbers, premium, though. The bootleg Kevin be premium, though. All right, let's skip this shit. Going out with a bang. You feel me? Huh? My last one on the... Uh on back on feed, that's what Heather said. It's my last one, so make it a good one. So, you know, I'm going all in. <laughs> She's like, read cameras. She said, she watch the cameras the whole time y'all being popular because she see him in the chat. She's like, that nigga said he on his way. Yeah, I'm really on my way. What's happening? Are you on your way to do what? What's happening? Nigga, come in this motherfucker and pop my shit. What's motherfucker, they feelings about me talking about AD and the situation with him, you feel me? Nigga sitting on the ground, Winnie the Pooh style, you feel me, with his shirt off, you feel me? He took an L. Nigga, gotta just stand on it. That's it, that's all. Motherfuckers acting like a nigga said, cut him off or something. We just clowning and talking about the topic, you feel me? I got all rights to speak on it how I wanna speak on it, you feel me? I said he took an L. I ain't seen no other footage, you feel me? And that's just, that's it, that's all, you feel me? He's still, you know, he's still good, he's still the homie or whatever, but he took an L that night, man, you feel me? He was on the ground putting his shirt back on. That wasn't cool. You feel me? Yo, that hop is crazy. That hop is crazy, man. Speedy recovery. Speedy recovery to smack. Yeah, we explained that. That's, so, that's it. That's all. I know y'all explained it, but I'm explaining it now because I'm the one that was on Instagram live popping my shit with who, about who? how I felt about it. With, and with who, who, who cared? Who cared? The people care. Everybody care. That's why they plastering this shit all around town. Who where? All over the internet. Where? Oh, you ain't seen it. I have not seen shit. Okay. You talking about back on Fig fan pages? I'm, you say you don't watch nobody pages, so I, I, I don't know what you're talking about. Back on Fig fan pages or on YouTube? Man, the shit everywhere. Your supporters, the people that, that's back working for free. Fan, I mean, not back on Fig. Yeah. I would just say Fig Community the supporters World. that's working for free. They posting so, it on their pages. So yeah, they don't pay. <laughs> yeah, they posting it. That's Some everywhere. Other pages. So, so my nigga, let's shout out to my hey, nigga. Yo, yo. Hey yo, big deal is T Rail's match. There's nobody in. The, I mean, I proved already that you know. That's neither here nor there, but. Big deal is T Rail's match, bro. That's why this has been so entertaining because the level of pettiness and wittiness between these two, hilarious. It makes for great content, but at the same time, y'all brothers. Like, I'd be damned if I do that with my younger brother on this. What? Posting this shit, man. Shout out yeah. to Big Deal, man. No, I ain't saying my shit. They posting this shit with AD. Yeah, they, who posting it? They didn't post it? No, they don't go post it. He the only nigga did that. Oh, well, yeah, that's why I probably seen it that. But it don't matter. You feel me? You trying to clean it up like a nigga can't speak on it. You who said that? Be, you, you talking about who posted it? Like, no, I'm talking me? about you talking. You came in here talking about they plastering it. I ain't seen it's it nowhere. It's been You don't look at nobody's shit. You said it out your own mouth. I don't. You don't even watch your own shit. I don't. So what we talking about? I don't know. Yeah. What are we talking about? We talking about what I posted. We talking about your girl DMing me. You need to check her. You feel me? She need to stop hitting me in my DM about anything, about any niggas I say anything about that's going on. You feel me? In it the podcast no, world. Look, motherfuckers need to, no, look, it, look, it need to stop acting like a nigga got to go to college. Now, shout out to Heather, man. Um, I do want to be on back on fake. You feel me? I do want to. feel me? They sent me the invite. I didn't already chopped up the CEO. He didn't already gave me the credit and was like, yeah, this little nigga nice, you know? We could uh, rekindle the conversation from there, but that's neither here nor there. I do got to speak on the fact that the reoccurring theme is Heather being in the like she's always in, in, in like the middle of the situation, like has some part to do with like a big viral or like a, a, a bigger scale argument, a bigger scale disagreement. Some way, some part Heather's there. And like, cool, you sympathize with Poetic Flacco when he came on your fl on, on your platform and dissed me and dissed my whole family and, and, and how I was sleeping at the car. That's cool. That's cool. I ain't really tripping on that. But, I mean, 
for T Real, for it to be a recurring thing, we heard Tiny say something, we heard Keem say something, we heard this person, we heard that person, Macwap, this, this, and that. And um to see it affect friendship, all right, cool, you know, friends is friends, but brotherhood? Now a lot of people might argue this is the mother his kids. Wife comes first, this is and I re- I agree, I, I respect that, but uh, big deal said multiple times there's been multiple situations where you've called me when you're in, in a situation and now you're on your platform condescending me demeaning me for for what to be a podcaster first of all you, you, know, first you first of gotta all, graduate from college to be no podcaster you, 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 you want but she tell you don't do that and go get you some chili so what, what you talking she about don't do what she a motherfucker about, asked me she, a question about your podcast and i said i don't just go over there like that i don't want to get that rock and she said go get some chili and you mad go get some chili she said go get some chili from where from podcasting she said go get some chili no she did let me see are you showing me the DM, girl? You, you talking about going to the chili? Shit. You start talking about Tiny, and I need to go do what Tiny doing. I don't want to do what Tiny doing. You, I said go to your car, and you can get the chili. I don't want to get in the car. That's so not my thing. That's thing. So you want to talk I'm for free? I'm here talking for free. That's right not cool. Now. Yeah, that we is cool. For free. That is cool. Me and this motherfucker getting chili. What you talking about? Nah, 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 nah. That's where, okay, like. But what What the fuck did you spend hundreds of thousands on a facility for if... You're not willing to let your younger brother utilize it for ah that that's crazy to me. And so when I heard that part yesterday, I was tripping like, yo, you're mad at your younger brother for wanting to be a podcaster and doing this, right? And so you're mad that the work you've done has inspired others. And then on top of that, because he's inspired, let me condescend and demean him. There's a difference between showing someone the hard work of attaining and, uh, and obtaining a platform of that level. But to say, go to your car, you go speak on it f- uh, for free or this, this and that. I mean, like your your platform. Uh, look, the chat, I'm reading it right now. It's nothing but bears up and down. This. So I was so confused into this, like, well, what was like the real actual issue with this because the chat rocks with big deal you got a platform you got a whole facility with different rooms in it and you sending him to go sit in the car I can help you out I can help, help my brother out wait, try to help me out oh, okay I'm telling you I'm trying to help me out let's do it right now I'll get you some chili right now cause. man you just talking right now you're in front of the camera I you think he was gonna pull up the pop and shit I don't give a I didn't know you was gonna pull up the cause I really handle the business I ain't talking about no you fucking you said pull AD. up though I ain't talking about no fucking you just AD. was talking about AD. yeah but I'm clowning and doing that I'm clowning too but we not we every not time I get to clowning some niggas niggas you don't want to get in you serious cause nigga I'm not serious I don't give a fuck about AD sitting on the ground nigga I'm clowning but the way I clown is different niggas are just clowns and be biased niggas be clowning and be biased and try to sugarcoat and make it look good why are you so mad about that I'm not mad you mad I'm not cause we just, every time Man, we talk about that, whole shit, nigga, every time up, we bro. talk about podcast, nigga, nigga got a problem with big deal speaking on something, nigga holla at me, nigga. Wait, wait, for what? Nigga, cause I said something, but nigga. But why though? Cause niggas be on whole shit every time what? I speak on something, no, nigga. No, they don't. They're trying to get you money. Who? Everybody. Man, Man nobody trying to do shit, nigga. This shit is going viral. You're capping. This shit is going viral. Why are we arguing, nigga? Cause what? You talking about I'm serious about a nigga getting marked out? This shit is getting viral. So if you sitting here talking about some shit going viral, why not get your money? That's Come stupid. On, if we want to hear you, we got bears in the chat. Let's get some chili. You ain't trying to do that. Why well, I'm not? Cause you not. Why well, I'm not? You not. Let's do it right now. What you need? What? I'm right here. Nigga, what, what, you you what you want? No, I'm so lo- like you telling them get some chili, but then you telling them to sit in the car and niggas need therapy. Oh my mama, niggas need therapy. Cause what? What? Te- this is the most. Like this shit just going like this, and they just spinning the block with the same argument. Create platform, just what I need. Right. Create something. Yeah, you got bears in the car. You got bears in the car. You got You want me to go sit in the car? Yeah, nigga. Yeah, I'm too saucy for that. What though. you mean too saucy? I'm too saucy I for that. It. You ain't sat no motherfucking car in this shit, nigga. House, nigga. Not my house, you not sat my equipment. house, nigga. In a little ass room. You sat in the house with some help though. What you mean with some help? You ain't in no car. This nigga helped me. Nigga, you said, nigga, no jumper helped you. Nigga, that's who. Nigga, that's who. You just put up and do. Ooh, we. Y'all know how I feel about my big bro Adam, man. Salute. My oh boy, you feel me? But damn, <laughs> I felt like y'all know we, we straight T real. We ain't got no issues, you know. I'm trying to, you know, come up there and pop my shit. And um, again, y'all did allow somebody to sit there and disrespect my whole family, my living situation and condition. But I've been fucking up these shorts, damn near six million views this month. But let's just say those numbers do like dwindle a little bit. I might come back around the corner. Like, hey, you guys remember when? Has allowed the guy to come and disrespect my family and myself, me and my living conditions, and you know what I mean. You remember, but um, that's that's neither here nor there. But um, 
Yeah, the fact that he brought up no jumper, like, bro, you, you, you speaking so demeaning and condescending. And I know we've squashed our situation, water under the bridge, but that's how I felt. I was like, it's like nothing's going to happen for you. And granted, like, I, I won't, I, I'm be humble. I'm going to continue to be humble. Gr- thankfully, God's working in my life. But yeah, I felt the same way. He was like, nothing's going to happen for you. This, I'm like, damn, bro, you pop, like, you talking to me like that? And, Oh, shit, I didn't even see Tiger was in the chat. That's crazy. Is that the real Tiger? That's crazy. But, yeah, he brought up no jumper. Like, bro, not all of us had the opportunity to be on no jumper for several years to, in order to, to go ahead and, and take this whole audience from somebody with a platform of almost 5 million people. We, we didn't have that opportunity. Now, granted, I'm not arguing whether you deserve it or not but i'm just saying you, that's from no jumper this from out the mud this from out the car the, the car situation to here not no you know what i mean and i still got to know yeah alhamdulillah shout out god but that that's a good point big deal is like bro hold on you all the, you know what i mean like i I felt hey, shit, nigga, he was on a whole nother platform. Hey, you didn't just hop up and get out behind you on that, nigga. Hold on. I helped you out with a lot of shit on that, nigga. Speak on it. Where'd you pop out? Speak on it. Speak on what? Nigga, on everything. Nigga, what you speaking on it. What you help me with, cuz? Nigga, with a lot of shit. Nigga, you homies up there, nigga. I tapped in on you and told you to put some homies on the platform. And I got them up there. Forget about the homies, nigga. Nigga, straight up, nigga, let's talk about it, nigga. You tapped in and tell me, oh, get him and put the homies on, nigga. We already got tapped in. We already got them. You don't even know them. I got to know them. I don't know none of them for real. I don't know none of them like a clown, nigga. I got no fool like I'm a dumb nigga. I ain't no dumb nigga. You don't got to be a dumb nigga. Don't never get at me like that, nigga. Be trying to get at me like that, nigga. You already know what's up, nigga. Don't get at me like that. I know what's up though. Nigga, you know what's up, nigga. But you know what's up, nigga. Stop getting at me like I'm a clown, nigga. I'm the only nigga that can give a fuck about you. Man, I, can't I tell. didn't did more than you. I didn't did more for you than you did for Hoover. Boy. You bailed me out before. Nigga, what? I didn't did more for Hoover than you did for Hoover. That's I didn't did more. Did. Nigga, what? Nigga, Hoover ain't never did shit for you, nigga. I'm the nigga. I'm a <laughs> motherfucking nigga. T real, bro. Again, for the hundredth time. Seek therapy, brother. Enjoy a cup of tea. Um, take a walk in the park. Like, 50, 60, like, you know, them ages ain't around the corner. And that's a beautiful thing, too, to be able to uh, to, to see them ages, you know, where we from. People don't really, uh, where we grow up in, people don't really um, reach those ages. So, for you to do that and thrive is a beautiful thing. But your health, you got to take care of it. Constant blow-ups. And that's, like, you constantly screaming at the top of your lung. Constant high blood pressure. Constant, like... That that's just gonna take in a, like it's gonna take a toll on you, brother. I swear to you, it's gonna take a toll. As we get older, all of these things take a toll. Nothing just happens in life and just disappears. Like, you know, there's consequences. So seek therapy because this is the most bogus argument. Like the most bogus argument, and it's sad to see that y'all brothers doing this. I know Heavenly Pies is upset. Y'all need to call Heavenly Pies and tell her like, we sorry we made a fool of ourselves. Sorry, won't happen again. Cause this, you're supposed to be a premier podcaster on the West, West Coast. Niggas look up to niggas. This type of shit that's happening. This type of shit, Paul the Flacco, cheer about. Ooh, yay, content. Ooh, Black Brothers fighting. Oh, my God. Oh, it gets him hard. Oh, that's how he gets hard. Black Brothers fighting. Yes, kill each other, shoot each other. Weird ass stutter box, bitch. Fuck you, nigga. Can't stop me. Shout out my boy Kev. Shout out my boy Adam22. Shout out all the giants that um God finna put on my way, you feel me? Ho ass nigga. But but um so like so so, so nigga. Fuck you, nigga. My mama. And I'm just getting started, nigga. 